to him. We should probably go talk to him. Alright, for this next match, we have Jump Steady versus PSI Guy. Let's see how it goes. Alright, we got Jump Steady versus PSI Guy. PSI Guy going Ness again, and we have Palatina from Jump Steady. Ness not hesitating to get that PK fire out there. Ooh, nice move by Palatina. There we go. The side B. Ooh, nice up smash read. And Ooh, then to the up great air. Great combo. Getting that neutral air, up air. Palatina is playing defensively and really capitalizing on the few moments that Ness has let his guard down. Oh, Palatina. Trying that yo-yo, but it didn't do it this time. Oh, nice up smash. Or up air. But, oh, there's the yo-yo. Uh, let's see how Jump Steady reacts to that. Nash trying his best to make a comeback, but it's just not good enough for him. And Palatina goes up. Jump Steady is running this game so far. We really need to see Ness finish out this stock. Ness coming in strong. No yo-yo that time. Palatina running these combos. Oof. Ooh, Palatina. Wow. That down tilt. Palatina looking like she's about to three stock. We might see a three stock. Oh, oh there not we go. Today. Not nice today. forward air. Nice forward air. Ness has a lot of work to catch up though. 88 8. Misses the grab to a nice spot dodge. Oh. And Ness just getting absolutely worked as a right now. Palatina is ready to capitalize any second now. Just, Seems just like beating him with that grab. Oh, the up smash read. And for game one, it's a pretty one-sided match. Always have to be careful about that, about Palatina. Getting up, she is expecting to do that up smash. Jump steady with an amazing first game. Let's see if he can capitalize on the second one. Okay. And my second commentator has left me with someone that does not know anything about Smash. If you guys enjoy this com uh, content, please hit a follow and subscribe to our Twitch page, twitch.tv 2G Gaming. All right, here we go for the second match. And Ness with the quick work. Oh. Palatina, though. Very nice.
What's up, everybody? You got Dynamite here back on commentary for PSI Guy versus Jump Steady. Looks like we're in game three here. This is turning out very interesting. Jump Steady, the number one seed here at this tournament. At first glance, it seems like he'd be very poised to take it, but PSI Guy not doing too bad even, he, though he's down a stock right now with that up smash. And that's it's just so explosive that it just takes a few good strings to get him back in the game. Jump study though spacing around Ness very well right now. He's being very mindful of the magnet mix-ups and the nares and the fares. PSI guy loves there's a lot of different styles of Ness, and PSI guy loves his aerial approaches. He'll always go for fares, he'll go for up airs to read people's jumps. Um he seems to prefer that over a more projectile like PK Fire, PK Thunder based style. And Jump Study's just been playing around it so well right now. He's already almost two stocks up, just as I've been saying that. That ledge trap he does with the down tilt is so consistent, so, so nice. And the up smash is a valuable two frame move. That up smash, I see Jump Study land that move so often, just covers so much space covers so many options. It's just an amazing ledge option. And now he's up three stocks to one. PSI guy in quite the predicament here in this game three. Looks like the town and city counter pick coming out from jump study is paying off in spades. Very smart right there to recover high to avoid that yo-yo, that omnipotent yo-yo there from Ness. So scary. And it forces errors just like that, as we saw it. Forced a Nair out of Jump Steady, leading to his demise. But that's just one stock down out of the three that PSI guy needs to win. And it is not looking in his favor right now. I don't know if that PK fires a misinput, but it doesn't matter, as Up Smash is not Palutena's only smash attack that covers the ledge. Wow. Dominant game three from Jump Steady right there. I believe that was a JV3. PSI guy gonna do here? I can't imagine he'll switch off of Ness. He plays a ton of characters, but Ness is far and away his best. I don't think the character was the issue there. I think it's just a matter of adjusting his playstyle. However, he does change his character to Rob. I was just playing his Rob earlier in friendlies before this tournament. I didn't realize it was already leveled up enough for him to consider it tournament viable. So this is gonna be exciting here. I can see this being a good choice, but it can also be a problem because of Reflect, as we saw right there. And Palutena's hitboxes, like up air, up smash, nair, they just cover so much space that since Rob's such a big body, I feel like he's just going to find himself in disadvantage a lot. However, the benefits of Rob is that he gets obviously gyro pressure, which can be very useful, but also pretty difficult to execute. Consistent grab follow-ups at most percents and just a really solid juggling game at advantage tape. However, that is going to be the stock there for PSI guy. His Rob looking a little rusty right there, pardon the pun. Let's see if he can de-rust and bring this game back in his favor because otherwise it's just going to be a one-way trip to the loser's bracket. Already in winner semis, of course, meaning that both of these players are guaranteed top six at this tournament, fifth place or better. But I know neither player is going to be satisfied with that. Everybody here at the people who get this far in the bracket are the people who strive for greatness. And PSI guy is just choosing to strive for greatness with his Rob right now, as he does get a nice little combo. I love that up tilt to up air, just adding on all the extra damage he can, not getting anything off the gyro, but he is dealing a lot of damage here. That back air evasion was so clutch, and he was able to get that stock so crucial. He really needed that. Let's just see how long he can keep this momentum going. Auto reticle. It's looking to be a bit of an annoyance right now, but very clever use of the side B right there. Neutralizing the threat of the explosive flame. Wow, and barely avoiding that up smash. He should be counting his blessings here because that is going to be a second stock. And now PSI guy on winner's bracket stock against Jump Steady's Palutena. 
what is he going to do here? I mean, this is just like, I've been talking about PSI guy a lot, but Jump Steady here has just been playing such a consistent play style, not over committing at all, just poking away with safe aerials, comboing when he can, camping with the auto reticle and explosive flame when necessary. Just a very balanced Palutena style, knowing when to go in, knowing when to retreat, and he, it's just working out so amazingly for him. Hitting so many explosive flames, that almost sealed it, and that will not seal it. But the explosive flame just barely sealing that KO. And Jump Steady moves on to winner's finals of Hat in convincing fashion. Great job to him. PSI guy in the loser's bracket now, but he's getting fifth or better here.